guys, it's your boy Repairs, and welcome back to my favorite city state, Braga Krum, or where last time I thought if I picked up wins in the league, and picked up a huge win in the Europa League, or top hotspurs in this episode, I have a game against Madeira, so the team named after a kind of cake, bizarrely, interesting, and, hmm? I will uh, be playing Standard Liege, and if I think I can qualify for the next for the knockout stage of the Europa League if I beat Standard Liege, so I will have to check that. But I think I, think I can. Oh, of course, need to make sure that. Is correct, or maybe I wrong. I'll have to check. But first, I have to play this team. And I guess it's probably not pronounced the same. Anyway, here's the kind of cake, but extra solidity. Yeah, that's right. I just made Mm -hmm. Strikers trying to do a job. Interest to see how they get on. That's beside the point. Oh, winning the challenge brilliantly and on the rebound. And it's 1 0. And Hansen, I said this in the last episode, he's really stepped up his game. Since uh, he slammed him towards the start of this season. He's been picking up the slack. And, uh, yeah. He's proven why AI should stick with him. One for the goalkeeper, I think. Played it back to him. Come on. Come on the pressure, and they might make a mistake. Nope, they got the ball away. Never mind. Should play because they know they can defend the floor. Santos, Augusto. Got a good defense. So the top ball. Hansen, is he going to score again? No, I hit straight the keeper. Because I'm broke. At least nullified this particular attempt. Oh, you fancied the striker there, didn't you? Oh, go Traore. Yes. Traore. Oops, in. Here's a chance to relieve some of the press. Traore. That's proper clearance. Well away from the danger zone. Rafa goes for a goal. And what was I thinking? Alan, what did you make? And maybe the keeper a little slow to go to his left there. He's over the top. Oh, 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 Hanson. Back into the middle. Ah! Because the pressure was starting. Here when that happens. Was timely to say the least. And of course, I bump straight into the player with the ball, and I can see a throw. Brilliant. They saw the guy could switch the play to, and came up with the pass as well. Excellent. Typified the competitive nature of this game. That tackle. It's only a throw in. Kisley. This is the ball out. Come on, Sewell. Nice over the top ball. Hansen's gonna get there. No, his control oh, was terrible. Oh, why not? Not sure why I went in for a slight tackle there. Mr. 
position here with such great passes. That's going to be a free kick. Yeah, no soon as I he made contact with him, and that was a free kick. They've licked up well. No! Oh! I got super fucking lucky there. Like, I got unbelievably lucky. Might get extra lucky. Hansen. It's not exactly the fastest, but. Support. Yes. No. Yes. What happened? I'm going to assume Timmans was offside. Hassan. That's in. Yes. Shoot. Oh, Troy. He can't get the rebound. A goal to the good, of course. I couldn't even put in the rebound. And it was almost served on a silver platter. And Charo is like, nope. No, I'm not hungry today. Well, he has cleared the danger. So in our corner, come on. Now I get this. Over oh, before half time. So then, penalty. Imagine. No, a oh, tumble in the box ends the first half. Brilliant. Going to be treacherous conditions in this second half. Braga. The rain is still coming down and the pitch is getting wetter and wetter. Santos. He slipped his man. Traore. Yes! Traore! Oh. Oh, it's Traore. Amongst players these days, the ability to use the neck muscles like that. Great header. It's about time I got this second goal. Oh, it has been coming. For as soon as he, he shoots these, falling over his own legs. But uh, as you work, two 0 fantastic. Bow. Really, Ruff? Really? That, that's no foul. What am I doing? Stop sliding in, Gordon. And shoots! Hit the post! You're in that! Preferably for Nat. Go, Augusto, go! Come on, come on, Hanson, he's gonna get there. And here comes the counter attack. And in goes the cross. Uh. Santos. Piano. Santos. Brilliant. Hansen. We've got his fist to it. Throw in here. I'll take the throw. I'll take the throw. Santos. Go for Rafa. Come on. Oh, I couldn't get my shot away with Triore. Ball was there and all. Yes? No! I'll take another corner. If I put one in. Termans! Damn. Santos. It's 
cut out that pass. It wasn't an accident. He read the mind. Of go, Rafa. Go. Go. Yes. Plenty of space. Plenty of support. Yes. Three now. Oh. Oh. It's a gusto, I think. Yep. Where's the Sant? Oh no, it's Santos. I saw it. A two. Wait, I don't remember. I couldn't see what the R number was. I assumed it was Santos. No, I assumed it was Augusto, wasn't it? Uh, Santos. Very well done. That's given them a comfortable situation here. Three nil. First league goal in a while. Scoring the last episode as well. Well, against Spurs. Great work by the goalkeeper. The ball is his, and he's made sure he's protected it. It's a bad pass. Come on, yes. Two man. Oh, it could be it. Hands in. <sighs> not turning the ball around. He's hung on to it. Of course not. You know what? I want the players to be tired, so I'm gonna bring off the more tired players. So it's in Triore. If I had more substitutions, I'd use them, but I don't. I wish I could take off Augusto and Tillemans, but uh, this is a this is a league game, not preseason. Can't change all my players. Make a change. Over the touchline, that'll be a throw. Well, uh, play, and the uh, new players will come on. Try that again, Rafa. Real good contest between these two as they jostle for possession. You know, that, that was that was incredibly shit. I got still. Wait, Adam might make a cup for it. Put it away for fuck's sake. Green ball. Mm. I'll take the corner. Telemans. No, are you freaking kidding me? And there's the full time whistle. The referee has now put that in the record books by blowing the Ah, in the end. 3-0, very good. A nice solid win. Fortunately, Sporting picked up a win as well, so I don't get any points on them. Let's see, Stenlidge are on 5 points. I'm going to take an assumption that Spurs will beat Chasm Sport, because, uh, well, Chasm Sport have been beaten by everyone. Apparently they're terrible. Chosen Sport, which really they should if everyone else is beating them. I Meaning Spurs have already beaten Chosen Sport because they've already played once. Because every team's played three seasons. You know? Makes sense. Uh, that would put Spurs on seven points. If I beat San Age, I'll be on ten points. No, I won't be able to. I'll only, really, I will only qualify, no, I can't qualify in this match, even if, I was going to say, if Trazen's 4 somehow beats Spurs, but Spurs 
would still be on six points, and I mean, they'd still be on four points, they'd be six points behind me, and they'd still be able to catch me. <laughs> Mathematically. You know, their goal difference is terrible after for the first after the uh, last episode. Sue so, can't qualify just yet. It's gonna come down to the next game, which I believe is against Trazen Spur again. So it's so Spurs will be my last group game. Well, now this Euro League group stage is beginning to take shape. We've got match day four. Anyway, let's focus on Stenro Liege. He says, Yeah, they, they made a bit of a fool out of me last time I played. I'm not going to let that happen again. More often than not, we're looking at teams that shape up this way, Alan. Yeah, such a popular system. 4-2-3-1. It gives you a lot of stability, and if you're front four, as you might describe them, uh, good players, it's a really potent system. Here we go. Let's start. Try our way. Boom. Straight away. If you look at the coaching manual, you don't defend like that. He's got caught two ah. to his man there. Paul. Andrade. Don't just stand there. I can't, I can't hit one and let me switch to the right player. If it let me switch to Tillman when the ball was near to the man, I would have gotten the ball and I'd probably already be celebrating 1 0. Fuck you, game. Now they've got a chance in this post up. Try to read. How you couldn't spill that, you damn twit. I was offside anyway. That's beside the point. One, yes, he's giving it straight to Hansen. It's one on one, and he's fucking missed you. Super. And of course, they missed again. Oh. This happened in the last time I faced these guys. I. He have lots of chances against them. Hmm? What happens? I made to rule those misses. Not this time. Penalty! Come on, you foul Chiori! Stop being offside! Gusto. Able to make a good interception. Schultz. These guys are really ticking me off. Good work, Rafa. Use that pace. Some potential in this move. Yes, 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 yes. Destroy you, shithead! Are you allergic to Belgian teams? Because you were terrible against Stanley Ish the first time as well. Players are a bit unhappy about this, but we can see it again whether it's offside or not. It's called offside. Oh, who'd be a linesman, but this linesman, he's one of the best and he gets it right here. Traore. Go. Not straight into the opposition. Avoid the people in red, you daft twit. I know you're used to playing in red, but you're in your way, Jersey. I so we'll go for the guys in the luminous green. Not the red. Half a yard on there. 
Seriously, you think none of these idiots have played football before? Uh, these guys in red, they must be my teammates because I play as the same cards as we do normally. Fucking squits. Sorry, I hit the mic. I mean, I've played beat building things before, and they're not that hard to beat. You know, I think I know what country is going to replace Portugal well, for next year's FIFA. It's going to have to be Belgium, just so I can. Hmm. Side. Hmm, find out what. Hey, they're apparently the, the ultimate kryptonite to the freaking in Portuguese clubs. Oops. And uh, they all act like fucking idiots and they're not doing what I told them to. Oh, he just touched it and like, oh, he ran away. What are you? Who do it? These two in the group stages of the Euro League. Second half now is underway. Yeah, it's such a high level of competition, you can see that in the quality of the play in that first half. Oh my god, my own teammates are defending against me! Whose side are you guys on? I don't care if he knew anything about it or not. That's he still got in the goddamn way. No, no, just stand around, do nothing. It's a good ball. They could be in. Here's the shot. <clears throat> yes. Try it right. Lash it. Andrade. Yes. Ah, oh, why did I press circle? I meant to press sex. Oh, pay attention. I'm saying pay attention to myself. Oh, oh come. Here's a chance. And, uh, just, uh, just ignore that. Come on. Yes. Oh my God. Head it the other way, you dumb twit. Come on. Of course you're offside. Of course he's offside. Why wouldn't he be? He needs a change up. Everyone is and they're tired anyway. So Gotta change it up. Can't have tired players if I'm going for three points. Let me switch to the right player! Changes feet. Could not for the life of me switch to the right player. Or, or, come on! Standing in the right position would help! Hallelujah! He actually did it! Someone did their job up against Standard Liege. It's a miracle! do it in these closing minutes well I think if I don't play any more Belgian teams this season or just don't play standard Liège again this season it'll be too soon
I don't know what it is, but my team just doesn't want to play good against them. Yeah, I'm one nothing up, but... They've been acting like a bunch of idiots for the whole game! That is a cheap piece of play to give the ball away like that. Like, what was that? What was that? The pass was... looks terrible because the player was out of position. In, in, to receive it. In the time that remains. Well, there's always pressure on you when you're playing in front like, of do, do none of you actually come to training? Do you just. Just like, nah, that's, that's, that's optional, isn't it? You also need a good training session of how to actually play as a team, because none of you seem like. You all seem like you're new here. Well, we're in the last knockings of the game, but. What? Barry? How did you miss? The goal was at your mercy and you still freaking missed. Schultz. Oh my god. Oh, thank the lord. Get rid of that. Lash it down the field. Oh, thank you, referee, for blowing the whistle. Oh, oh thank God that's over. I don't even care how Spurs got on against Charleston Sport. I, I seriously don't care. I got the result I needed. Thank God I don't have to play them again. Like, seriously, Spurs... I really hope Spurs won because I cannot comprehend how shit this team plays when they're against instead of age and for no particular reason. I mean, Stanley Lees are a good Belgian team, but come on. Can't turn to useless tossers when you play them. Oh wow, Chelsea Sport got their first point. Huh. I didn't even talk about what would happen if it, if it was a draw. Although, a draw doesn't put me through to the next round either. But I'm almost there. One more win. So if I beat, and I think it is Trazen Spore, I don't think it's in the next episode. I think a. Oh no, it is the next episode. And it is Trazen Spore. So that would be helpful because then I can simulate the Spurs game and not care. Because not only will they. Will they get me through. Because I'm five points ahead of both first and then for the age, I can also go finish top of the group. Because one of them's ha gonna have to drop two points. Or, eh, hang on, no. One of them will either drop three points or they'll both drop two. Which will be brilliant in either scenario. Cool. If I could have one team to win that match, it'd be Spurs. So, Spurs do for duty. That will be in the next episode. But until then, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Smash the like button if you did. Subscribe for, for content very, very soon. And until this time, I hope you all. Have a very, very nice day.